The European Union is marking 20 years since the so-called Big Bang expansion, when 10 more countries joined the bloc on May 1, 2004. Around 75 million people became citizens overnight, and the EU became one of the world's largest single markets. European Council President Charles Michel says it's time to further expand. Enlargement is vital for the future of the EU because without enlargement, this is in fact a risk for a new iron curtain and this would be extremely dangerous if you would have an unstable neighbourhood with a lack of prosperity, a lack of economic development. These are a common interest, the candidate countries and the EU to make progress, to, to speed up. I am confident because I feel that the, the leaders, a vast majority of them, they are absolutely convinced this is important for the future. Nine countries from Eastern Europe and the Western Balkans are waiting to join the bloc, including Ukraine, which Hungary opposes. Others include Albania, Serbia and Turkey. The process is long and complex and involves candidate countries having to meet EU demands, including significant judicial and constitutional reforms. All EU member states must approve any new inclusions. For instance, we've used the constitutive abstention, which is giving the possibility for a country to say, look, I don't like, I'm not very comfortable with this decision, and I make public my opinion, but I don't want uh, to block the vast majority of the member states which would like to make progress in a certain field, a certain domain. Michel says countries closely aligned with the bloc's economy could enter the fold in the coming years. He says the next Big Bang expansion needs to happen by 2030.